everyone today we're making penne with sausage ragu you will find all the ingredients in the description box below let's start with some olive oil in a hot pan you want to add some chopped onions straight after let that sweat for a few minutes before adding uh, your garlic add some red chilies for some spice and also a couple of tablespoons of anchovies then you can add your sausages but make sure to remove the skin first Break up the sausages into tiny pieces and then add some fresh thyme. Stir the mixture thoroughly, making sure to scrape the bottom of the pan. It might look like it's sticking, but that's what we're looking for. And then add some dried oregano. Add your sliced mushroom and keep stirring. You want to deglaze the pan with some water or if you have some white wine, that's also good. You can start adding your marinara sauce. I've used about a cup and keep stirring until the bottom of the pan comes clean and all the sticky bits have come off. Add some freshly ground black pepper. I like using some white pepper as well. Season with salt. Then you can add your passata. Followed by some cream. This will make the sauce very nice and rich. Leave the sauce to simmer for a few minutes and then add the chopped tomato immediately followed by some fresh oregano Then stir the mixture Then cover with a lid and leave to simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes Meanwhile you can start cooking your pasta so make sure you've got a pot of water already boiling with some salt and cook the pasta according to the package instruction. When your pasta is nice and al dente, drain it off and then add some butter. In the meantime, your pasta sauce should be ready. Add the sauce to the pasta and stir. You can add some cheese if you like. I'm using a little bit of cheddar. Add 
and then I've also used a couple of tablespoons of uh, Parmigiano Reggiano. I've also sprinkled with some fresh oregano. And here we are, the pasta is ready to serve. Make sure you're eating it while it's still hot. Just before serving as a garnish, you can sprinkle with some more parmesan and some fresh oregano. This is my favorite part, the taste test. And the verdict is, it was absolutely amazing. The pasta was nicely al dente, um, the sausage was perfectly cooked, the sauce was nice and creamy and rich. The anchovies gives a little je ne sais quoi in the background. So it is an absolute must. And this definitely goes into the clean plate edition. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time. Happy cooking! Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe!